welcome Chris Rock. Yes. <laughs> he is praying that Will Smith wins. Like, please, Lord. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. All right? <laughs> Boom, Booker. Kudos. Uh-oh, Richard. <laughs> Keep my wife's name out your Will Smith just smacked the shit out of me. <laughs> Everybody talking about kids. Everybody talking about how bad kids is. You know it's bad. But see, you can't say kids bad. I said, hey, these motherfuckers bad. Sassy, talk his head, shaking his shit. Talk to the hand, talk to the hand. Don't tell me all this shit. See, it ain't the kid, it's us. See, we some punk ass parents, see. See, we the put ass parents today. See, we, I need to go back to the old school, because there ain't no grandmamas no more. Ain't that a bitch? See, ain't no grandmama. Remember Big Mama? See, Big Mama gone. See, you a grandmama now, what, you 24? <laughs> Great grandmama, 36. Talking about I ain't babysitting shit. <laughs> you know that, man. You know you got your ass whooped, so you couldn't even talk with Big Mama talking to the grown folk. Remember that? When Big Mama was talking to somebody, you had to shut what they called the fuck up. The big mom was talking to somebody, she said, girl, you know, I went to the store, I got two tomatoes, some taters, some lettuce. No, you didn't, big mom, you got, and like I said, you are, uh, when I got the motherfucker, she said, knock the paws in your motherfucking ass. You know you hurt when you cry and you pause. You ever had a pause? When the motherfucker hit you in your throat, make your teeth click. You bite the back of your tongue, you can't cry. <laughs> When you cry like that, man, your soul is up. You hurt. Remember how you used to get a whooping in the street? Now people get all in your business. Don't do that. Don't say that. They got a leash on you at the airport. I see one with a leash on the kid. Come here. Come here. You're going too far. I wish I would put a chain on my goddamn hood. Stay there. Don't move. Don't move, motherfucker. You shouldn't do that. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> See, my mama chaser. Me and my wife been in the house walking around naked eating and everything. Shit get broke. I know who the fuck did it, you know. Now I got three new people in my damn house. I got my sister's children living with me now. I'm about to go crazy like a motherfucker around here, you know. See, my sister on drugs. I ain't ashamed to tell you. Some of your family members fucked up too around here. But my brother called me in North Carolina. My brother said, he said, Matt, you got to come home, man. The court going to separate the kids. I said, no, you know, I, I can't hear that. I can't hear that. I said, I'm going to be there. Now, mind y'all, North Carolina, I know them, but I don't know them. You know what I'm talking about? I know the kids, but I don't know these motherfuckers, you know? Two, four, and six. Ooh, shit, come help me babysit these motherfuckers. I get there, I'm in court. The judge said the Mack family, I stood up, I said, yes, Your Honor, I'm part of the Mack family. He said, we're gonna separate the kids. I said, Your Honor, you mean separate like divide? <laughs> he said, very good, Mr. Mack, very good. I said, you know what? I said, Your Honor, I can't allow that. I said, my brother and I, we're gonna split custody. That must be turning his back on me, like he didn't say shit. <laughs> yeah, pump some of my bitch, see, you know, Cain killed Abel, you know what I mean? I said, Your Honor, I'm going to take the kid for six months, and my brother going to take the kid for six months. This punk son of a bitch, get up and walk the f*** out. I ain't seen him since. If I ever seen him, I'm going to f*** him up on sight. 
I'm gonna bust his head to the white meat. I'll slip all over. Y'all gonna read about it. Whatever I see this mother gonna be a misunderstanding. There's gonna be some furniture moving around this mother. <laughs> I said, young, I take the kid. Now I got these three, some of my bitch, give my friends. That's what I want to say, you know. These motherfuckers on my goddamn nerve. Y'all gotta pray for me. And that two-year-old, she the motherfucker, she the ring leader. This never been here before. She a shepherd for the devil. She worked for the devil. Then the six-year-old, my sister was really getting high with her, cause she don't talk, she don't say shit. All she do is look at your ass like this here. I told her ass the other day, I said, let me tell you something, if a fire break out, you better have a whistle or a horn or something. Cause you gonna be a burn up motherfucker with me. I ain't got talent for no deaf mute. Talk! Holla! No, I'm trying like this. And the four-year-old here. Woo! Yeah, yeah. No, I ain't gonna need you on the no walk all like this here. Crying all the goddamn time. Quit crying, just a push up or something. I came in the house the other day, man, at 1.30 in the morning. The two year old gonna send the <laughs> downstairs for some milk and cookies. I'm going upstairs, he coming down, he gonna walk past me like I'm a visitor. I said, where you going? He said, to get some milk and cookies. He said it so funny, I wanted to hear it again. I said, get some what? Is this American Cog? I told him, I said, man, it's too goddamn late for some damn cookies and milk, man. Take your punk ass upstairs and get some rest. That's how I talk to him. I got time for these badass kids. These kids are kill you. They're gonna kill me. I'm gonna kill them. I can see y'all reading Jet and Ebony right now. I got he talking. It's a shame how Bernie fucked up those damn kids. I can't get no rest. They walk around the house three, four o'clock in the morning. Got their finger under my nose, seeing if I'm breathing, all that kind of shit. Then this other man gonna sit up there, she gonna go upstairs. The two-year-old, I heard the two-year-old say, Where the cookies and shit? He gonna tell her, Him downstairs. Who the f is him? Like I ain't got no name or something. Him downstairs. The two-year-old said, well, I go get this shit myself. <laughs> she gonna walk her little bow leg down there. I'm standing in the corner. I watch her get a little step ladder. She gonna go on over the refrigerator. I said, what the fuck you doing? She looked at me, I'm gonna get some milk and cook. I said, didn't I tell your punk ass boy he couldn't have no goddamn cook? Are you listening when I tell the he could have had a... Now I'm telling your short ass, he can't have no goddamn milk cookies. Get your punk ass up there before you get fucked up around here. Oh, she gonna look at me like I'm short, you know. No, no, can I? Everybody in this room know what that look mean. That look mean you wanna do something to me. So I backed up. And I told her, bust a move. Bust a mother move. And I'm out of this mother. My kids got baptized at a black church. Wasn't prepared for that. I, mean, I just, I, I prefer white church myself. Black church just takes too long for me. You got to have your day free. You can't make no plans going to a black church. Yep. Hey, what happened? You plan on going to a football game, you ain't gonna make it. Hey, you might not make Monday Night Football while you're bullshitting. <laughs> black Church is ridiculous, man. Remember the first time I went to Black Church, I, I didn't know it was gonna take that long. Like, I didn't eat breakfast that morning. I thought I was gonna eat in about an hour, you know? Oh my God, I almost died of malnutrition that day. I was sitting there in the church, man. I was like, why, why is this taking so long? You know, just, you know, when you go to church with white people, man, we don't say nothing. You know, we shut up and we listen. You know, if somebody tries to talk while our preacher's talking, we tell them, shh, zip it, focus, okay? One more song, we're gone. Peace, peace. I don't have any time for any gossip now.
Yes. For the first time I went to a black church, um, I, I didn't know, I, I didn't know that when black people agree what the service is about, they don't wait. They get up right there that they agree. I know it's okay to yell out. I'm sitting there. I don't know why I got in the whole church. I'm getting upset with all the black people in the pews around me. You know, I thought they were being disrespectful to the preacher. I know it's okay to yell out. I'm just sitting there. Preach on it! Are you serious? Just gonna talk while he's talking? Yeah, that's really disrespectful. Once you zip it and focus, it's 1.30! I'm ready to go home! Talk about it! Are you with him? What? You're allowed to talk? Are you serious? I'm gonna say something. Okay, watch, I'm gonna say something. Hootie hoo! <laughs> I heard it, Virginia. Come on, it's 4 30! <laughs> Another song! Why is she singing Rihanna? That has nothing to do with church! It's 6 o'clock! You guys have a step team? Are you serious? The first Baptist steppers, it's 8 30! A freaking poet? This is a talent show! That's the four times she caught the Holy Ghost, she's lying! You can't catch the Holy Ghost four times in one day, it's 10.30! Stop passing this plate around! I don't have any more money! It's midnight! It's Monday! I'm late for work! Listen, since, since, uh, since we do got quite a few black people in the audience tonight, um... There's a few things you guys do that, that bother me a little bit, okay? And I just want to share what they are, and if you could work on these few things, black people, it would really make my life a lot easier. It really would. So, it's nothing big, nothing big, because I, I know right now there's a couple of brothers in the audience like, uh, where the is this joke going? Hold on, hold on. F first thing, black people, first thing. Um, black people, could you guys please, please, please start celebrating your birthday on the day, not the whole month is that too much black people god damn black people got the pre-bass and the post-bass my wife's birthday's in may she has some girlfriends come over in july i was like where are you going we going up for my birthday i was like your birthday was two months ago but they wasn't here it's not your birthday no more you're a Taurus. you're not a leo you can't celebrate into another sign and some people live by them astrology signs. I don't know them all. I know I'm a Leo just because I'm a Leo. The only reason I know is people always tell me because my birthday, I'm a Leo, right? I'm one of them barely made it Leos, though, because my birthday is July 26. Three days earlier, I would have been a cancer. Yeah, yeah ain't, no, ain't nobody trying to be no cancer. Because a Leo, we a lion. We the king of the jungle. A cancer, what are you? You a crab and cancer. Two things nobody wants. Nobody wants crabs and nobody wants cancer. You just dying and itching. Fuck! What's wrong? My birthday, July 8th. <laughs> I got a lot of black friends on my Facebook page, too. Black people, the only people I see post this on Facebook. Oh, shit, turn up. It's my birthday month. <laughs> it's one day. White people, we don't do that shit. We celebrate our birthday on the day. Birthday's on a Tuesday? It, we go to Cracker Barrel. Call tonight. Maybe get a free Coca-Cola cake. Get some pancakes and a salad. That don't even go together. It's my birthday. Today it does. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna get sweet tea and unsweet. You getting both teas? It, it's my birthday. I'm getting two teas. You see a white dude on Instagram got two glasses of tea at Cracker Barrel. Damn, I'm fucking getting in at the barrel. You ask a white person, you going out for your birthday? No, it's on a Tuesday, but 2019, get ready. Saturday night, it's gonna be crazy. Yeah, I got a party bus. I'm making payments on it right now, so I should have it paid off by May 2018. So, yeah, I got it for six hours. White man did give us Black History Month. Yeah, he did. That yeah. was mighty generous of you. That yeah. was mighty white of you to give us Black History Month. 28 days. 28 days more than your black half hour and a half. <laughs> 28 days of every day of that week. You agree with me on this, don't you? Yes, I do. Every day of them 28 days. The black man should have his black ashy ass knee down on the ground, praying and thanking the white man for giving me them 28 days.
And what, what y'all do with it instead? What they do with it instead? Mm -hmm. It's Black History Month. Let's barbecue and rob. Break yourself! Y'all need to be out there thinking the white man for giving you that. He didn't have to give you that. Hell, I think he ought to have a month where he just take everything away he done gave the black man, don't you? Wrap this shit up, let's go! God damn it, let's go! Oh man. Just take be... it right away from him. What month? It don't matter. Whatever month he choose, he gonna keep you confused. It might be January. It might be March. Hell, it might be February when you think it's Black History Month. That's take back month. Yo, your right to vote? Give me your right to vote. You don't need that. You don't use it right no way. Barack Obama. Oh, your president. Yeah, the niggas did, the niggas did elect themselves a president. I guess we may as well let y'all have a few years just to see how much y'all can fuck things up. Let's give them a half black man in the office. Mm. So I enjoy the white side of him. You do? But the nigga side of him is just dumb as a bucket <laughs> of donkey. <laughs> so what side of him is white? He gets that from his mother or his father? Well, the way that he can speak, I like that. That's from his white mother. <laughs> and then all the stupid ass laws he's making, that's from his nigga dad. Folks wanna pop off and have opinions? Present a specific plan. Uh -huh. Aha! Absolutely. Tell me some of the things you cook that they are proud of. Like, Dad made some. You got the best spaghetti. You got Excuse the best me. steak. Excuse what do you have? <laughs> I, 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 I what you I, as a father of seven with an unlimited food budget, you can make. Uh, whatever is necessary. I said seven, what they like. Excuse me. Excuse uh, excuse me. me. I said answering. what are they like? You, you Just because think? you're a poor interviewer doesn't mean. <laughs> Dr. Uh, I said you <laughs> answer the question and just tell Man, me. Man, you're what a they strong like. black woman. <laughs> is it okay for question. me to answer? Come on. You keep interrupting the answer. Oh Everyone can hear it. It sounds like you like me a little bit. It's starting to bleed over the airway. <laughs> <laughs> it is. Oh, really? I want to let everybody on. know that Wanda got some lipstick on right now with enough glitter for the 4th of July. <laughs> That's right. Kissable lips. How many kids you got, Wanda? I have three boys. Excellent. Yes, I do. Aren't boys simple? Mm hmm? Aren't boys simple? Um, they can be. Yeah, show sure ass. Yeah, yeah. 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 Wanda knows she did. I'm what? She didn't do as much cooking in the latter years as she uh, did in the beginning. Oh, uh, whatever. I cook. I do it all. I didn't say that you well, didn't. Well, that's right. I did it in the beginning and the middle and the end. What's your favorite wait, wait, thing to wait, cook? Wait, wait, your wait. boys, um, yeah. They like for me to cook. I do a really nice broccoli. They like my broccoli <laughs> and they love my baked chicken. Hey. Hey, right now, look up your phone and see what it takes to make broccoli. And tell me, does it say, he doesn't say heat up water. That's the only step in broccoli, heat up water. Simmer. Have you ever heard of burned broccoli? Can you burn broccoli? You can't burn it because it's made in a pot of water. You don't know nothing about You know what her second meal they love from her? What I do with corn. Oh, whatever. I like to dig it out that can what? and I put it in there. And then I get a can of water and I put it on there. And then I get some Zatarans. They don't expect that. I sprinkle uh, Zatarans I am a great corn. cook. Aww. Whatever. Yes, ma'am. You good at heating stuff up. Uh, you're good at Ooh. telling us about what's going on in jail. Yes, ma'am, and getting out to tell you. <laughs> but I'm going to tell you at an arena named Phillips, and you going to tell me at the Atlanta Comedy <laughs> That's Theater. Right, true. Tomorrow, be there. All right. Fred Grant right. show. I know Fred I'll Grant. be there. Don't miss it. <laughs> thank Fred Grant, <laughs> Cat Williams, yeah, thank y'all for coming through, man. Yes. And thank you for having me. Thank, thank you. you for coming in. I see why people come to Wanda's show. Yeah. Because Frank Ski puts it down. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> get on out here with your crazy ass. Uh-huh. Is he crazy? <laughs> and here up and get to the salon. All right. It's the People Station View in three. Your hair is kind of... <laughs> that joint was... My hair is 19 inches long and I have no perm. <laughs> you don't? <laughs> Oops. Oh, that's not a perm. No, it is not. Nice lady. That's come natural. Come run, come run one of your gnarled fingers. <laughs> Why you on air? What, what, come so on. they can hear you live. Come on, come on, let me come over here. No, no, no. That's not how that works. Oh, okay. Well, then stay over there. Don't worry. Ain't nobody putting their hands through yours. That's right. They don't have to. Uh -huh. I don't want them to. Get on out of here. You okay? <laughs> you okay? You right Only one of our hands right moving right while we talk. Are you all right this morning? Are you okay? Red Grant, oh. Atlanta Comedy. Tell Wanda and to take sure, off them headphones and, and that sure, wig. And make sure. That wig and that headphones and take come off together. Them old ass clothes you got on. 
How about that? Yeah, they're old. Versace, yeah. Oh, uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It she said, Versace. I want to apologize to the people at Versace Collection. This is, this is your 2019 summer but, line that but, hasn't but, come but out. You, but you had but, to open it up and but, show us it was it, Versace. I want to just No, I didn't have to open it, it up. Did, These people are on radio. They can't see anything. Yeah, but you opened it up so we could see it. Yes, we ma'am. It. Well, happy, happy, happy. And happy, happy whatever for stores for the Black Lane Bryant. <laughs> Very oh, proud. Okay, let's Very play some proud. music real quick if we can. We going to a break real quick? Very All right, proud. cool. We go to a break. Shout outs to Forever 21. Yeah. Necklace collection. That's right. <laughs> Shout out! They don't to remember me for a while now, I right? I'm not the me. right one to Jones though. Get this inmate out of here. <laughs> if, if, if you can't get your blood pressure down, you can't call me that. Uh, whatever, little mama. If your cholesterol is 600, whatever, little mama. I'm little mama's baby daddy. No, you little mama. Uh, yes, ma'am. Hey, and what are you, girl? <laughs> you probably shouldn't talk about sizes. No, that's okay. You big on the radio. Oh, that's right. And you're, and you're big Turn in prison. Turn it down. And you're yes, big in ma'am. prison. I've never been to prison. Uh, you have 19 felonies, no convictions. Yeah. Knock it yeah. off. Prison okay. and jail aren't the same. No, no, okay. no, no, no. Calm, calm no, 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 no. Only one calm, of us has twelve dollars worth of jewelry on. Uh, no, 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 twelve dollars. No, 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 no. That all is available. If you want to, if you want to have Wanda's jewelry, please uh, go to go Sit Go, go or Shay. Quick Come Trip at any cat. point. If you buy cat. two packs of Newport 100s, they will give you everything Wanda has on right now for seven ninety nine, and it comes with a free car wash. Won't you come on down? Yes, thank you. Absolutely. We appreciate it. Go the Shay, show starts at nine. Her. Wanda gets to the stage at nine seventeen. Uh, please Shay. come on down. Go Shay, please come get Miss Cat uh-huh. and do her. She's hand. almost out of breath. Be careful now. Now, even on the radio, you yeah. can hear the fact that exercise has crept into her vocabulary. Yeah. Well, we mama. We're done. You already used that one. Don't yeah. repeat your jokes for us. Oh, God. Like, ladies, let's discuss. Hey, look, let's discuss harassment for a second. Why can't I harass you? Sometimes, sometimes, I can never harass you, never. And I'm not talking about. Like I'm talking just. At the job, it's unfair that I can't harass you at the workplace, like. (laughs) You looking how you looking, and I can't just a little something. Like, you gotta be careful just to say, hey, you look beautiful today. That's how messed up the game is. I think you should be able to comment on any part of the body (laughs) that you see. If you, what's your name? What's your name? Jeannie. Now, Jeannie, no disrespect, but if I work with you, I should be able to walk in and go, oh, Jeannie, beautiful uh, titty meat you have there. (laughs) Wonderful. And, because I see that, but whatever the scientific term is, I'm looking at Mr. A 4.9 grade point average. What's the, What's the science term for uh, t- the titty meat? What's the actual? And it's not the cleavage. I mean, the cleavage is the space in the middle. I'm talking about the meat, the, the meat, the titty part. And I'm not being foul, just, you know, whoa. You know what I'm saying? Just so I can go through the rest of the day without pretending. My mind's telling me no. That I don't see, which, which, you understand what I'm saying? I mean, let's work out a deal. Don't get me f- fired. <laughs> Yo, killing me with this. Aha! Uh-huh. Having women work with men, right, is like having a grizzly bear work with salmon. <laughs> Dipped in honey, like so. Now you dip the salmon in the honey, right? Grizzly bears. And the salmon get to walk through comfortable with honey and fish and good morning, grizzly bears. And the grizzly bears is like, hey, 
can't even, he can't even growl. Like, ah, what's up, fish? Oh my God, human resources. The grizzly bear just did grizzly bear stuff. So, <laughs> so, like I can't even go, hey, good morning. Good morning, fish, good morning. Oh, I can't touch it like, oh, look at that. Oh, let me just get a little bit of that fish, a little bit. Get that honey, oh my God. Fish and honey, man, that's my favorite. Usually I kill fish and eat them and stuff, but I just wanted to just rub that, rub a little bit of that. God damn. That's oppressive, like you shouldn't even, and there's cameras everywhere, you can't do like weird stuff behind a back, like. Why would it be disrespectful I said, what's your name? Ter Terrell, if I go, hey Terrell, we work together. And I go, Terrell, hey, do me a favor, let me know when you're getting up to go to the bathroom so I can sniff your chair. <laughs> Boy, if you don't get Yeah, boy. That's disrespectful because it's sexual, but that keeps me from being... Like, I think, look, I think there should be a holiday, uh, for lack of a better word, harassment day, but not, that sounds whatever, but I mean a day where I get to find out. Like, because, and this is why it should be harassment day, because women get to be inappropriate sexually all the time. You get to be inappropriate. And when I say inappropriate, I mean say hello to me too close. Hi. He needs some milk. Or some weird massage because you think we're friends and you, good morning, a little kiss. And he's just like, oh, oh boy, oh boy, 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 boy. And you think in your head, man, I wonder if I could, I wonder if I don't you know. <laughs> but harassment day allows you to be able to ask. All year, I say the Tuesday before Thanksgiving. <laughs> and, it's, and it's a beautiful day, flowers and everything. You buy a flowers. You just real cool, you walk up, you're respectful, you say, hey, how are you? You know, good afternoon, Terrell, happy harassment day. <laughs> and you just like say, listen, I was wondering all year if you would suck my dick in a broom pot. And you just be like, no, thank you, I'm not. And you'd be like, I'm, thank you, keep the flowers. I just thought, <laughs> I made a mistake. I thought you was a hoe all year. I was confused. I thought you was a hoe, but you're not. Hey, I gotta go, man. Y'all take care of yourself.